Hello everyone, thank you for listening to Christ Talk Radio. Christ Talk Radio has a new segment entitled Talk the Bible. Talk the Bible is a program where we're going to be discussing the Bible itself and how it relates to current day issues. But before we discuss the Bible, you know, we need to know what the Bible is. We need to know the purpose of the Bible. So in this particular episode, I want to start by asking the simple question. And Austin's going to be answering some of these questions, well, this particular question and other questions we have regarding this subject. Is the Bible a religious book? Austin, can you give us insight on that? Thank you very much for the question. The Bible is not a religious book. I know today the devil has succeeded in making the Bible seem like a religious book. The Bible is not a religious book. The Bible is a spoken. The Bible is a prophetic and a written word of God. If you read the book of 2 Timothy chapter 3, verse 16, say, All scripture is given by inspiration of God. The men that wrote the Bible, they didn't go to university. They didn't go to Harvard or Harvard University. They are not PhD or, or, uh, or uh, uh, professor. They are not uh, doctors. Yeah. They are inspired by God. It is a an inspiration word of God. Mm -hmm. It is a spoken word of God. It is a prophetic word of God, and it is a written word of God. If you read the book of Second Peter chapter 1, verse 20 to 21, say, Knowing this first, that no prophecy of the scripture is of any private interpretation. It's talking about the Bible. It's not of any private, which means it is known by the, the knowledge of man. So which means... Somebody didn't just sit down and come up with it like a storybook or like a, uh, Ima a fantasy. Or movie. imaginary uh, uh, book like all those uh, uh, Harry Sci Potter, Harry Potter mm -hmm. and those. No, it's not. For the prophecy came not in old time by the will of man. It's not the will of man. But holy man of spoke as they were moved by the Holy Spirit. They were moved. Those men who gave their, themselves to God through the Spirit of God, the Holy Spirit, they were moved to speak what we see as the Bible today. Mm -hmm. If you read the book of Deuteronomy chapter 18, verse 18, also said, I will raise them up, a prophet, from among their brethren, Mm -hmm. like unto, and we put my words in his mouth, and he shall speak unto them, or I shall command him. This is God talking, talking to the children of Israel. He said, I will raise up a prophet, man that will be my voice, that I will use to relate with people. Mm -hmm. So this, the Bible is a spoken, before there was no Bible, it was a spoken word of God. It was a prophetic word of God. In those days, they have what they call scroll. You understand? Uh -huh. this is a, it's a prophetic word of God, a spoken word of God, and it's a written word of God. Finally, I would say by, if you read the book of Second Samuel, chapter 23, verse 2, King David said, the spirit of the Lord spoke by me, and his word was in my tongue. King David was talking about the Spirit of the Lord spoke by him. He spoke through the Spirit of God that inspired him, mm -hmm. that moved him. So the Word of God was put in his tongue to address his people. So the Bible is not a religious book. The Bible is not a religious book. It is the Word of God. Another thing that I want to point out is the Bible also says that the disciples or the ones who wrote the Bible, they were unlearned. It was because they were in the presence of God that people knew they had been with Jesus as they spoke. So that also shows that they were inspired of the Holy Spirit. Yeah, that is true. They were inspired. They were not learned, like you said. 
if you see religious book is always come from elite people those who are who use their own wisdom if you if you if you read a book if you read this religious book book like uh, in uh, uh, buddha buddhism uh, hindus you will see that these are people who are elite people who are who, who use their own imaginary uh, and that's that is that is religious but the bible is not it's not that's why the bible talk about god the bible didn't talk about man they didn't talk about about our what 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 we feel like but they talk about god how we can relate with god how god created us mm -hmm. so in this segment we have learned that the bible itself is not a religious book mm -hmm. so i hope you guys enjoyed this segment of talk the bible stay tuned for more bye bye